When people hear of North Korea, they typically think of the dictatorship currently running the nation. They think of the regime and all of the stories that have come out about the country. But have you ever considered what type of wildlife lives there? In today's video, I'll be discussing the most dangerous animals in North Korea. Please be sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Number 1. Jellyfish There are around 123 different species of jellyfish that reside in the waters around the coast of the Korean Peninsula. Of those 123 species, there are about 100 that are known to be poisonous to humans. If you happen to take a swim in the waters off the coast of North Korea, you'll likely come in close contact with one of these jellyfish. The dangers each of these creatures possess to humans varies, but the most dangerous jellyfish found in these waters is the Nosora's jellyfish. A sting from one of these massive jellyfish has the potential to be fatal to humans. If stung, people are encouraged to rinse the contact area with salt or fresh water. They are also encouraged to seek medical attention immediately. Allergic reactions can also arise when getting stung from one of these jellyfish, which can make the situation even more serious. Number 2. Wild Boar Wild boars are commonly found in the mountainous regions of North Korea. These animals are herbivores by nature, but that doesn't mean they aren't dangerous to humans. If one of these wild boars is provoked, surprised, protecting their young, or mistreated in any way, then there is a large chance of an ensuing attack. The wild boar population has continued to grow in recent years, which has caused some to travel down from the mountains in search of food. These animals are also known to attack if in a state of starvation. Human fatalities have been known to occur due to encounters with wild boars, so be extremely careful if you ever find yourself face to face with one. Number three, the giant Asian hornet. In terms of the most dangerous animals in North Korea, the giant Asian hornet is one of the most lethal. These hornets are huge and are in fact the largest in the world. Although a single sting from one of these hornets isn't known to result in human death, they are known to attack in groups, which can indeed lead to fatality. Their nests are usually found in the mountainous regions of North Korea, so if you happen to be taking a hike in the mountains, beware. Much like the other animals on this list, it's best to be aware of your surroundings and do not do anything to provoke an attack from these massive hornets. An attack from a group of giant Asian hornets can result in paralysis and death. Number 4. Mosquitoes Mosquitoes are found throughout the world, and most people have seen them at one time or another. They are considered dangerous in many countries due to the diseases that these bugs can carry. Whether you're in the mountainous regions of North Korea or on the streets of Pyongyang, Mosquitoes will often be there. Mosquitoes in North Korea can carry a host of deadly diseases, such as malaria, dengue fever, Zika virus, and many others. Precautions such as vaccines, medicine, bug spray, and mosquito nets can give you better chances against contracting a virus or disease. For those who do not have the resources to protect against a mosquito bite in North Korea, the situation can be much worse. Number five. The Grey Wolf The Grey Wolf is quite common in Asian countries and is often seen in the mountainous regions of China, Mongolia, Russia, and Korea. Although Grey Wolf attacks are said to be uncommon due to their fear of humans, attacks have occurred. If these wolves sense danger from your presence or if you get too close to their young, then an attack can indeed occur. You can also be attacked if you run into a wolf suffering from starvation. In general, if you don't provoke an attack and you keep your distance, then you should be fine. Number 6. The Surrey Brown Bear This brown bear can be found in the countryside and mountainous regions of North Korea. Although there haven't been any recorded attacks coming out of the country, I think it's safe to say there have been at least a couple. Other Asian countries such as Japan have reported many attacks on humans from the same type of bear. These bears possess sharp claws and an extremely strong bite force. They can also run at high speeds if in pursuit of prey. As long as you're careful and are aware of your surroundings, you should be fine. That being said, it is not wise to travel into the wilderness of North Korea alone. Number seven, snakes. North Korea is home to five types of venomous snakes. 
These include the Japanese Pit Viper, the Tiger Keelback, the Amur Viper, the Asuri Pit Viper, and the Mamushi Pit Viper. The most dangerous of this group, the Mamushi Pit Viper, has hemotoxin in its venom, which causes tissue to liquefy and break down. While these snakes aren't known for unprovoked attacks, they will bite if stepped on or gotten too close to. Overall, if you see a snake in North Korea, stay as far away from it as you possibly can and watch your step when walking in the grasslands or mountains. Thank you so much for watching my video. Help my dream come true of doing YouTube full time by subscribing to my channel and leaving a like. Have a great day. Check out my online store, David Allen Prints. I mostly make products that are tailored to different cities and states in the USA. You can find coffee mugs, hoodies, t-shirts, iPhone cases, and candles. I truly love making YouTube videos and would love to make it my full-time job. So if you want to support me, check out the shop. Get 10% off at checkout with code DAVE. Shop link will be in the bio. And if your city or state isn't on one of my products, DM me on Instagram and I'll add it to my shop. Thank you very much.